Now, the WGAL News 8 Storm Team Forecast with meteorologist Christine Ferreira. Good morning. It is 550. We're taking a live look here over Lancaster. You can see we have clear skies this morning. All is quiet. Temperatures not all that cool, though. When you step out the door, it's certainly going to feel more like summer. So our News 8 Storm Team forecast today says mostly sunny, warm, 80 to 84 degrees. Temperatures more typical of the end of August, beginning of September, as opposed to beginning of October. Tonight, mostly clear. We'll add a little patchy fog like we have out there this morning, and it'll be mild with temperatures close to 60. Tomorrow, more the same abundant sunshine, few notches warmer, certainly going to feel like summer here, 82 to 86 on our temperature range tomorrow. Looking back at yesterday, we almost made it to 80. It was 79, average is 72, though that's the key, and records are up near 90, so not quite record heat, but temperatures will be warm enough, at least for early October. Here's a look at your currents. 54 in Lewistown, 63 in Lebanon, out the door in Lancaster, we have 59. It's 60 in Chambersburg, clear in Gettysburg, you're at 61. On Super Doppler 8, nothing to really point out, hardly any clouds in the sky. We do have a bit of fog northwest of Harrisburg, but that should dissipate by 8, 9 o'clock. But really, nothing coming down the pike here. We don't have anything to show you besides a big area of high pressure. On the predictor, there it is, big blue H moving right toward us. So today we have more of a northerly wind keeping our temperature in the low 80s, but by the time we hit Tuesday and Wednesday and high pressure slides just overhead or to our east, we'll be seeing more of a southerly wind helping to kick up those temperatures into the mid 80s by midweek. Now toward the end of the week, we're waiting for a cold front to come in. You see it there. It'll take its time getting here, but I do think we fall back to about 80 on Thursday and by Friday we'll see more clouds and a couple of showers coming in with that cold front. Over to the tropics, we're still following Philippe here. It's close to the northern Leeward Islands. There are some tropical storm watches posted, but Philippe is going to head northward here later in the week, away from any land, and could even strengthen into a Category 1 hurricane, but it poses no threat to land after that. Here's a look at our 10-day forecast. Back home, lots of 80s. We have 82 today, tomorrow, Wednesday, Thursday. Overnight lows will be in the 60s. Pretty hard to get in the full spirit there. But by the time we hit Friday, that cold front approaches. It comes through on Saturday. You'll notice it turns a bit breezier and cooler over the weekend. We'll have some showers mainly on Saturday. A couple lingering into Sunday and Monday as the core of cold air lingers overhead. But next week, temperatures are back in the 60s, which is below average. It seems like we can't get an average day. We're either well above or well below. Average highs next week should be closer to 70.